Opening Prayers, Prayer 1 Thanksgiving Blessing, O Lord, we thank you for this earth, our home, for the wide sky and the blessed sun, for the ocean and streams, for the towering hill and the whispering wind, for the trees and green grass. We thank you for our senses by which we hear the songs of birds and see the splendor of fields of golden wheat, and taste autumn's fruit, rejoice in the feel of snow, and smell the breath of spring flowers. Grant us a heart opened wide to all this beauty, and save us from being so blind that we pass unseen when even the common thorn bush is aflame with your glory. For each new dawn is filled with infinite possibilities for new beginnings and new discoveries. Life is constantly changing and renewing itself. In this new day of new beginnings with God, all things are possible. We are restored and renewed in a joyous awakening to the wonder that our lives are and yet can be. Amen. Prayer 2 Prayer of Gratitude Thank you, Lord, for the blessings you have bestowed on my life. You have provided me with more than I could ever have imagined. You have surrounded me with people who always look out for me. You have given me family and friends who bless me every day with kind words and actions. They lift me up in ways that keep my eyes focused on you and make my spirit soar. Also, thank you, Lord, for keeping me safe. You protect me from those things that seem to haunt others. You help me make better choices and provide me with advices to help me with life's difficult decisions. You speak to me in so many ways so that I always know you are here. And Lord, I am so grateful for keeping those around me safe and loved. I hope that you provide me with the ability and sense to show them every day how much they matter. I hope that you give me the ability to give to them the same kindness they have provided to me. I am extremely grateful for all of your blessings in my life, Lord. I pray that you remind me of just how blessed I am and that you never allow me to forget to show my gratitude in prayer and return acts of kindness. Lord's Prayer Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever and ever. Amen. Day 4 Day 4 Scriptures for Meditation Luke chapter 14 verse 30 saying, This man began to build and was not able to finish. Scripture reference, 2 Chronicles chapter 15, verse 7. But you, be strong and do not lose courage, for there is reward for your work. Scripture reference, 1 Chronicles chapter 28, verse 20. Then David said to his son Solomon, Be strong and courageous and act. Do not fear nor be dismayed, for the Lord God, my God, is with you. He will not fail you nor forsake you until all the work for the service of the house of the Lord is finished. For those in diaspora, for their contribution to the welfare of their brothers and sisters in their mother countries. A Pope's Prayer for Immigrants Merciful God, we pray to you for all the men, women and children who have died after leaving their homelands in search of a better life. Though many of their graves bear no name, to you each one is known, loved and cherished. May we never forget them, but honor their sacrifice with deeds more than words. We entrust to you all those who have made this journey, enduring fear, uncertainty and humiliation in order to reach a place of safety and hope. Just as you never abandoned your son as he was brought to a safe place by Mary and Joseph, so now be close to these, your sons and daughters, through our tenderness and protection. In caring for them, may we seek a world where none are forced to leave their home and where all can live in freedom, dignity, and peace. Merciful God and Father of all, wake us from the slumber of indifference, open our eyes to their suffering, and free us from the insensitive bond of worldly comfort and self-centeredness. Inspire us as nations, communities, and individuals to see that those who come to our shores are our brothers and sisters. May we share with them the blessings we have received from your hand and recognize that together as one human family, we are all migrants journeying in hope to you, our true home, where every tear will be wiped away, where we will be at peace and safe in your embrace. By Pope Francis. Prayer to God of love and compassion. 
may we always recognize your spirit in the refuge family seeking safety from violence, in the migrant worker bringing food to our tables, in the asylum seekers seeking justice for their families, in the unaccompanied child traveling in a dangerous world. Give us hearts that break open whenever our brothers and sisters turn to us. Give us hearts that no longer turn deaf to their voices in times of need. Give us eyes to recognize a moment for grace instead of a threat. Give us voices that fail to remain silent but which decide instead to advocate prophetically. Give us hands that reach out in welcome but also in work for a world of justice until all homelands are safe and secure. Bless us, O Lord.